I don't even understand why this even exists or how I ever participated. Coming to realize that I've been taking babies away from their mamas, I think that was probably, that's been the hardest thing. But it's stunning. It's stunning to me that I, I was like, how did I not see it? How did I not? The last time we took babies to the sale, the mothers were just like waiting, bawling. crying, bawling. Babies were crying, bawling. This is all this chaos, which I used to only hear is like, it annoyed me. You know, we're down there working and I'm, I'm like, what? I can't hear you. But that time I was like, these are mothers crying for their babies. But now, knowing that every baby that's been born here since then gets to stay with its mom, gets to stay with its mother, and the mother gets to keep her baby. I don't want to curse, but I don't want to say, I don't know how I ever f with that. Back in October, my, um, my daughter, she was eight months pregnant, and we'd already had the baby showers and everything. And she went into labor, and we went to the hospital, and there was no heartbeat, and the baby was gone. And to witness that, to witness my very human daughter's heartbreak um, because her baby was gone, it shook me, it changed me on a soul level. Um, that that is not, humans aren't just the only ones that feel that. You know, I've been around enough animals. I've been around, you know, dogs that have had puppies, cows that have had babies, cows that adopt babies that aren't even theirs, that they have this beautiful, lovely maternal instinct, just like us. And for us to just be taking that and, and thinking that we have some kind of right to meddle with that at all. And it's not necessary. It's so, totally not necessary. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and it's and, and that truth is hidden, and it's being hidden every day and covered up, so people won't see it. Mm -hmm. Based on around money. When I was with Tyson, the yearly bonuses went out for the CEOs, and one of the CEOs for Tyson got twenty six and a half million dollars as a bonus. What kind of bonuses did the farmers get that year? <laughs> <laughs> One year they brought us a ham, a box of chocolate. Yeah, a box of chocolate. That was Something awesome. Like that. You know, everybody grows up into the culture that we live in right now where, you know, we eat animal products and processed foods. That's a lack of education that needs to be taught. For the future, it's, it's much more sustainable than what we were doing and a whole lot better for humanity.